privacy. After 2016, Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram are definitely the main ways most people are getting information online. She needed to follow their rules. But this only made her believe her own bullshit even more, thinking that she is being censored for telling the truth when it is the exact opposite. From 2016 and still to this day, she's constantly making new social media accounts under various names and trying to avoid being deleted. She started a GoFundMe for new house furniture. She became a flat earther for a while because that was trendy. She faked another pregnancy in 2018. She made her way back on YouTube in 2019 as Tornado Theon. This time, she was spreading the good word of Jesus Christ. At this point, she's done so much damage, I do not think that any of you can be convinced that she has changed or has good intentions. I know I can't. She has been consistent with this new, godly behavior up until today, despite getting deleted every few months for justified reasons. Mostly an unhinged amount of racism that I just, I, I don't even want to amplify it, I just don't want to put it in this video. She just makes a new account and somehow manages to get views, probably because she is getting support from a small community of Christians who don't know about her past, or her own delusional cult fan base that follow her no matter where she goes. While there isn't anything wrong with praising your own religion or sharing your own ideals, it just can't be at the expense of others. Tila has always made it seem like she is the only person living the right way, and that everyone else is wrong. On top of that, she's directly and indirectly spreading so much hate. How is that godly or pure? Let alone her insane claims of being an alien, being a goddess, being Jesus, being a four-dimensional cyborg, or whatever the fuck. She spreads hate and is very openly racist. Instead of taking responsibility when she says horrific things, she just says, oh, that was Lucifer speaking, or that was the devil. I was possessed, that's not me. I'm not big on censorship. I think it's destructive. But Tila has shown time and time again, for over a decade, that she cannot handle social media. She cannot stop spreading hate. She is a bad influence on people. She does not apologize, nor care about the people she hurts with her psychotic ideals. She does not deserve a platform, and we can only hope one day she decides to delete her social medias forever and get help.